Now, it's no secret that I did this through Amazon FBA. So to start off, let me give you a backstory on how I got into e-commerce in the first place. 2023 is the year to make money. And in this video, I will tell you how I went from being broke to earning 126,000 a year. So during my last year of university, both me and my boyfriend at the time, which is now my husband, were unemployed. He was studying for his pharmacy equivalency exam. And I was going through my last year of university and I was very stressed lots of exams so I said I cannot handle a job right now so we were both unemployed and we wanted to do something to earn some extra cash and that's why we started our own Shopify business and at the time we were selling lashes we were selling men's bracelets and we were selling sunglasses and we weren't just selling through Shopify we were also selling on Facebook marketplace to our friends and family and we were also doing pop-ups in music events since my husband was a DJ and he had a lot of connections in that field so I finished university and I started working several jobs just like anybody would when they finish university City, they would straight go to look for a nine-to-five job and I got a couple of jobs I hated it and I just ended up quitting and I quit cold turkey and decided that I was gonna give myself one year to make money from my e-commerce online business since I realized that the nine-to-five life was not for me now, obviously I recognize this is a luxury that most people don't really have. So I am very grateful for that, but just stick with me here because I'm going to explain to you why you don't necessarily need to do this when you're starting your e-commerce business and you don't need to do this to be successful at it. So at that point it was COVID and I was already married and my husband would go to work every morning as a pharmacist and he was doing COVID vaccinations actually. So I would be sitting at home alone, basically really bored. And this was essential to my success. I think being bored is very important because when you actually sit with yourself alone in your own boredom, your brain starts to get really creative in thinking of different ways to, whether it's, you know, come up with content for social media, or maybe if you're interested in it, then making more money. And obviously that's what I was interested in. So my brain started to think of new ways to make money through my e-commerce business. And I started to research Amazon FBA. So yeah, guys, I think sitting with yourself and being bored and forcing yourself to sit in boredom is very crucial to your success because that's when you actually start to take action on things that you've been procrastinating. So I, in initially had the idea of Amazon FBA because my last nine to five was actually me managing a fashion business's Amazon store. And I saw how much money they were bringing in every single year. It was over a million dollars and I didn't even like their products. They was very basic leggings, very basic jeans. So I thought, hey, I have these sunglasses and I already have this business. Why don't I try to do it myself? And since I was home alone all day, five days a week, I was just consuming as much information and as much content as I can possibly consume. So I watched YouTube videos and I took a course and let me tell you, guidance is key when it comes to your Amazon business because this is a new territory and you're not necessarily sure on how to navigate it just yet. So you will definitely need some guidance when you're starting your Amazon journey. All right, so this is the rebate website and it's amazing because you can get new products that just launched on Amazon for up to 90% off. You can even sometimes get them for free. So it depends on what the seller decided to do as a discount. Um, and yeah, you can browse over here depending on your category. Let's say for example, you're interested in home and kitchen. You can click on the category right here and you can just browse through the different products and get them for huge discounts. Let's say, for example, you like this product right here and you clicked on it, you are going to buy it on Amazon. So first you need to create a rebate account and then you get your discount code and you just move forward with buying it on Amazon normally. So yeah, this is an amazing option for Amazon buyers. So thank you so much rebate for partnering with me on today's video. And along with starting an Amazon journey, I decided that I was going to apply the same exact marketing techniques that I was doing for my Shopify store 
to my Amazon store. I just realized that it was so much easier for my customers to shop on Amazon and take advantage of that prime shipping. So if I was to, you know, pair this with this, which is the marketing techniques, the sending out to influencers, the Facebook ads and all of that. And if I was to pair it with an Amazon listing, I felt like that would be a match made in heaven. So I really started to see consistent results when influencers started to receive their packages and post about it as an Amazon product and as an Amazon find that's when I started to see consistent sales and obviously with the sales came reviews and that also increased my daily sales as well since I had more reviews so essentially all I was doing was finding sunglasses from a supplier in Alibaba and I made sure that they were sunglasses that I really liked because I was going to be wearing them posting pictures taking videos and trying to market them as much as possible on my end so I had to make sure that I actually liked the style and I actually still have the same style today this is the style that I started with one year ago and I still have it we have it in five different colors and I wear it every time that I wear sunglasses I usually reach for these so essentially all I was doing was getting these sunglasses from a supplier in Alibaba I was putting them in my brand's packaging so my box my insert in the packaging my pouch my sunglasses pouch which i have over here so this was the sunglasses pouch that we came up with it's just white leather so i was putting it in my own packaging and putting on the amazon label on the outside of the package and sending it straight off to the amazon warehouse so it wasn't even passing through me all i have is samples like i only have one of each color if i want more then i can send more to myself but i only have one of each color all of the inventory is actually at the amazon warehouse now i talk about this formula or this certain triangle in my course and i will have my course linked below but essentially, if you want to have a successful Amazon business, this is how it goes. First, you need to have the perfect product. Then you need to have an optimized listing. Then you need traffic. And in the center of all of this is you need to have the right mindset to hustle and work for your business. So if all of these work together at the same time, then you will have a successful Amazon business. But essentially without even one of these pillars not working, then you're not going to really see the results that you're looking for. Now, yes, I made some money on Amazon and let's actually do the math on how much money I made exactly. Because when it comes to my profit margins, I actually have a 25% profit margin, which is on the lower end. And I'm going to explain to you why it's on the lower end. So my profit margins were around 25%. So if I earned 126,000 in one year, that means I actually took home $31,000 in a year, which obviously Amazon is not my only income stream, but if you had an extra $31,000 a year, I'm sure it would help out with your you know, expenses, with your bills. I'm sure it would make you a lot more comfortable. So this is the idea with Amazon is that it doesn't need to be your only stream of income. It's actually very easy once you get it up and going. You don't need to work on it a lot. You essentially only need to work on your business around two to four hours a week. I barely even work on my business two to four hours a week at this point because I have somebody on my team that does the influencer marketing marketing and that does the outreach I don't do that anymore myself and then we just schedule the posts for our social media and our Facebook ads are scheduled as well and running on their own so essentially I don't do much until I have to restock my product but I think I could have earned way more money if I did not start selling sunglasses so I had the pillars working for me I had an optimized listing and I was driving traffic to my listing but I did not have the perfect product now my thing is that I actually was kind of already married to the product before I started selling on Amazon I already had my sunglasses store I already had inventory I already knew my supplier and I just didn't want to go through that all over over again from the beginning when I started my Amazon business so I just started selling sunglasses and I tried to choose a style that was not already on Amazon but with sunglasses the profit margins are very slim and it's a very saturated market it's mostly Chinese suppliers that are actually selling those sunglasses so they sell it for a ridiculously cheap price so my profit margins just weren't there yes they were 25% which is okay 
but I could have done much better if I was doing a different product or if I was selling a different product. So this year I am applying this exact formula, this exact triangle and finding three new products and I'm gonna start selling them on Amazon and my goal is to make at least half a million dollars in sales by the end of the year. So we're going to keep up with that together guys. I'm going to share my journey. I'm not gonna share my product until it's actually launched but eventually I will and I'll let you know how my journey goes. I am filming it and I'm talking about it as I go right now. I just received my third sample and finally found the best quality one and I will be launching very, very soon. So yeah, I hope this video was helpful to you guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you are interested in starting your Amazon business, you can check out my course down below. I have a course and I have also free training um, that you can check out in the description below. And thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye. Thank you.